get those bands Niggas clap, only fans No games for a bit, it's time for that shit Rockstar with all of my hits They all on my dick, ice on my wrist Yeah, roll me a split Can't fuck with the gang, we ain't the same Talking that shit, get you back What's good everybody, I'm Brandon So, listen, listen I was just editing my videos See my laptop, oh, still in my bed I was just editing my videos on my bed and I saw that I mentioned uh, about Adrenochrome and my family got reaction. And I don't know, I was just, as I was editing my videos, I was just sitting there thinking like, bro, what if some of these conspiracies are real? Wouldn't that be crazy, my guy? All right, if you don't know what conspiracy I'm talking about, let me, it's, it's about the reptilians and the Adrenochrome. So let, let me tell y'all, let me tell y'all. So there's a conspiracy out there that like the, the Illuminati are the world leaders, they're reptilians. And the reptilians are like shapeshifters and they can look like however they wanna look. That's why some of them say like, oh, Justin Bieber and other people they were saying are shapeshifters, they're, they're uh, reptilians. But anyway, that's that one is so far out there, I don't think that that's real, but if that's real, that shit is in fucking say my guy. Listen, I'm a little with the clouds. You already know, I told y'all that in the earlier videos. You know what I'm saying? So they're saying, yeah, the Illuminati reptilians. And y'all heard about the, the children kidnapping, right? The child sex ring and how they be kidnapping children. So, there's a conspiracy that not only, of course, for child sex trafficking, but also that the global elites, the Illuminati who run the world, the top, like, 1% or whatever, that they, um, they, they kill the kids. And when they kill them, they drink their blood. And it's called adrenochrome. So, basically, they they get the kids fearful, right? So, they, they scare them, of course, because they kidnap them and stuff. And they bring them to whatever, wherever they do their ritual. So, the kids are scared. And since they're so scared, they have adrenaline. All this adrenaline pumping through their body. You know, your fight or flight response. So, it's pumping through their body. And they're scared. And they said, like, that's when they kill them. And they drink from their adrenal glands. And it's supposed to help them live forever. What if that is true, my guy? Bro, if that is true, the world that we live in is is out there, nigga. You know what I'm saying? Like, I already know. The, I already know the world isn't what it seems. I already know that. You know what I'm saying? I've had my experiences. You know, I told you guys about my spiritual awakening experience that happened December 2018 and how I became the man that I am now. I told you all about that. So y'all know. That was basically kind of like the start of my spiritual awakening. It was December 2018. And that's what made me dive into a lot of different um, a lot of different information. And that's why I also found out about these conspiracies. But I'm just like, yeah, I don't know. I've been doing research ever since then. I still do research. But like, what if that is true, man? What if the global elites, the, the fucking top 1% or top half of a percent, you know, 0.05%, what if... They actually are reptilians, right? And they are shapeshifters. You know, they control everything. They control everything, of course, since they own all the world's wealth. So then they own all the companies and the companies push their agenda. See what I'm saying? That's why I be telling y'all athletes and fucking musicians aren't in the Illuminati. If they have to push the agenda, they have to push it because the NBA is telling them to push it because the person that owns the NBA is being told by the Illuminati. You see what I'm saying? The Illuminati is way back here. And they telling people and it trickles down. Like how corporations work. Because that's how... Anyway. That's how I believe the Illuminati will work. It only makes sense. But, so they're saying those people who are the... That basically own everything, right? That they're the reptilians... And yeah, they're the shapeshifters, and they're the ones that basically fucking drink the adrenochrome so they can live forever. And that's why they be kidnapping kids, because yeah, some of them do the pedophilia stuff, you know, and then other rituals. They be killing them and sacrificing them and drinking their blood and stuff. That is insane. I want to know what y'all think down in the comments. I wish this was live, bro, so I could really talk to you guys back and forth. I should have did this live. That would have been fire. Because we could have a back and forth conversation. So I really want to know what you guys think about that. I think it's, I don't know. I think it's insane. But like, if something like that is going on, then you know there has to be an opposing force. It can't just be the Illuminati or Reptilians and that's the end of it. Nah, that don't make sense. 
if if there's bad, I'm, there gotta be a good. So just like there's light and dark, you know what I'm saying? Just like you have bad and good inside of you, you have high vibrations, low vibrations. So if that's happening with the reptilians on this side, then there's an opposing force on the other side. So if you believe in the reptilians, who's the other side, nigga? That's, you see what I'm saying? Like, bro, it's just a rabbit hole that you just go down and you're like, nigga, if any of this is true, I can't believe it. Like, I don't know, man. It's hella interesting. Like reptilians kidnapping children, drinking their blood so they can live forever, drinking their adrenochrome. They got other people on the pedophilia stuff that want to be on it, or even if they don't, but they probably make them so they can have something on them, and that's how they're probably controlling them. That's part of the... All right, let me tell you the next part. Let me tell you the next part. All right. So the reason why y'all be hearing about, like, these rituals that people have to do, you either got to sacrifice somebody, you either have to um, do pedophilia, or basically you sell your soul or whatever. So... Um, some other conspiracy theories say that the reason why that they make people do that is because it gives them power over those people. You see what I'm saying? Like, let's say, let's say you want to be a famous musician, a famous artist, right? Fuck, I hope this isn't the case. But let's say you want to be rich and famous. So the person that's in control of whatever to, like, all right, you want to be rich and famous. So you sign to a label, right? And let's say you want the label to maybe push you all the way. They're saying that there are rituals that they make people do in order for them to really like push you. So for an example, I don't want to say me because I don't want to speak this to existence. But fuck it, I don't want to use anybody's name. Y'all going to be like, oh, you're saying he did. You know what I'm saying? So let's say, let's say a label signs me, right? Let's say a label signs me. And I'm just on a label. But if I really want to get pushed and if I really want to be in a limelight, they're saying the conspiracy is that I have to perform a ritual. As in, you gotta do fucking sacrifice. You gotta fucking uh, do something pedophilia. Do some pedophilia. Or you have to sell your soul. You basically gotta do something in order for them to have something on you. So it'll make you want to continue to push their agenda. That's why like the big time rappers and stuff, the big time artists, they can't say certain things. Because if they do... It's like the people that own them, they have something on them, and they're afraid they'll use it, you know? So that's part of the conspiracy, too, man. I don't know, man. So many conspiracies out there. Hopefully, I explained that well. Y'all know I'm in the clouds. I'm chilling. But that was, yeah, man. If it's really like that, that is crazy. That is insane. Damn. But then you got to think about what's the good side. Because I told you, if there's light, there's dark. And so if you believe in this dark, there's a light over here too. There's an opposing force. So who's that opposing force? What if the opposing force are us, the humans? But that's why they keep us so sleep, so they can continue to do this. What if we are the opposing force? I'm dead. Bro, I'm high. See, these are the thoughts I be having, you know? I'm a thinker. I'm a creative thinker, and I just be thinking shit. But what if we are the opposing force? And that's why they keep us all hella dumbed down. They keep us all sleep. So we can't oppose them. Mm. Sheesh. That would mean that the reptilians are winning the battle easily. Like, you feel me? <laughs> they got everybody sleep and they doing what they doing. They chilling. That is insane. Or what if there's fucking reptilians and fucking angels? And the angels are the opposing force. But them niggas is trash. They just lose it. <laughs> oh. Okay, okay, let me stop, let me stop. I'm really having a good time being high talking to y'all, even though I'm just talking to a camera. Does that make me crazy? Probably. Let me know what y'all think down in the comments, man. I'm in the clouds. I just wanted to share that with y'all because I just wanted to get that out. You know what I'm saying? I wanted to tell it. I don't know. Let's just have a conversation, bro. For real, for real. Let me know down in the comments, man. Love y'all. See y'all next time. Peace.